Hi folks, um, it's Valentine's Day, so happy Valentine's Day to everybody and all my love to everyone. And I hope everybody's feeling loved, wanted, and if you're not, pff, I love you. <laughs> Which is worth its weight in gold, obviously. Um, I wanted to do the Valentine's Day tag before it got any longer. Deirdre asked me to do it, so especially for Deirdre and Lupus Life, I believe her channel's called. I think, actually, it's Deirdre's Reborn Hobby and Lupus Life. And I'm totally unprepared for this, so um, we are having little Jack again, just with his cardigan and hat off. So that's very lazy, but still with these booties on because I can't bear to take them off. And I'm just looking at him here. This is the sort of thing I would have hated when I was... Um, when my kids were little, seeing uh, an Abby in the photograph. Anyway, so I'm just going to do this quickly, fire through them. Valentine's Day, overhyped or a fun day to spread the love? I really think it is a fun day to spread the love. It's fun, fun, fun. Um, I don't think there should be any pressure. Um, I understand. I remember when we were at school, you know, making the Valentine cards and so on and writing verses. Uh, uh, loved all that of course as little girls do but nowadays I appreciate um, just you know feeling loved and, and knowing that um, I'm lucky I appreciate everything I have and everything I, I, I get uh, I don't think I think it can be overhyped I don't think it should be Having said that, my mother, it was her second anniversary with her bloke, my stepdad, yesterday, and they, she got a lovely ring, an Art Deco antique ring, so it, beautiful, beautiful. So, you know, whatever floats your boat. I don't think there should be any pressure, as long as there's no pressure. Favourite Valentine's Day memory? I don't really have one. I was absolutely stunned that my hubby came in last night with a card for me, and... Nothing says, uh, you put a few quid in the card, of course, and nothing says, I love you, like a fillet steak and a bottle of pink gin. So we had a lovely night to ourselves last night. Because we're on our own, it doesn't often happen. Conversation hearts or chocolate-covered strawberries. Do not like chocolate-covered strawberries. And conversation hearts might well be those um, love hearts, we call them here. Well, I would eat a few of those. I have been known to. And if Luke gets a selection box with them in, or if Luke has a few, I, I would still have those. But not chocolate strawberries. They're foul. Foul. Choose a celebrity to be your Valentine. The only celeb I love is uh, Russell Crowe. So probably him. Who are you ce celebrating Valentine's Day with this year? Well, I am. Um, we had it, as I say. Albert and I had it last night. Um, Damien wasn't home, Luke was gone to his mother's and so just us too, which is how we like it. And I'm very lucky that we survived all of all of the lockdowns, me in for five months and only seeing Albert and then we both got COVID together and you know, weren't right beside each other day and night for the whole couple of weeks. What's your Valentine's Day dinner plan? Well, the fillet of steak. <laughs> Albert's very favourite thing is fillet steak and mine too and he doesn't just buy the steaks he'll buy the whole fillet so um, we had enough for last night and tonight and even Damien's going to have some tonight uh, red or pink red always uh, sushi or pizza pizza always love pizza beer or wine uh, either not mad about either but would enjoy it and as I say last night it was uh, pink gin step up baby blue um, describe your perfect valentine date night probably like I had last night I'm not a going out person and we had a lovely tea and a lovely night to ourselves where we just listened to our own music and actually I had taken a couple of videos which I'd totally forgotten about thanks to the pink gin and uh found them today uh, where Albert and I are singing along to our favourite song 
our, well, one of our favourite songs. But it's nice just to get, uh, just to get a wee uh, night to ourselves. So anyway, Valentine's Day tag done. Hope you enjoyed that, um, Deirdre. And I think we should all do more tags soon. And I hope you like the little man again. I mean, I don't have anything nicer that I could show you. Apart from maybe one of the turtles or one of the parrots, but you can't trust them. But, so I'll just share the cuteness. Okie dokie folks, speak to you soon. Have a happy Valentine's Day and I love you all. Bye.